What's going on, guys? It's your boy DJ Hotsets here, bringing you guys a brand new video. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I'm Shirley, and because I'm one, I'm playing the beta. Two, I'm max level, and three, I'm bringing you guys a video on Infinite Warfare. And what this video is going about, it's not about the gameplay. It's just it's about the opinions, what I think I could do better, or not I could do better, but and it, like you know the game could do better in general. And also I'm going to get some opinions from my friends, uh, from Chaz and Blake or Balaki. And to see what their opinion about the game, if they think the game would be good, or the game could be bad, or what could be changed, or competitive wise too, because we, I'm going to be a lot, play a lot more competitive at the beginning of this game than Black Ops 3. So I'm going to hop into the party that they're in, and um, I'm going to try play a game with all of them all together. So I'll be right back. Cooking, fellas. So I have a few questions to y'all. I know um, about this, you know, fantastic game of this or the beta. So, what do you guys like about <gasps> the beta or the game in general? And what are you excited for? Uh, I really like it. I just can't wait to actually use like the classic guns, like the UMP and shit. Like those are gonna be awesome. Ooh, he got melted. That's unfair. Do you agree with you, with How about you, Blake? Um. I like the movement pretty much, but the only thing about it, the movement is that it's like slower, but it's still pretty good. All right. Anything else you guys like? I personally like the like you said the movements, and I can't wait to full game to play it. But like I personally like everything. You know, it's just it feels good in my hands right now. Yeah. You know? yeah. And plus, like, oh my god. like oh, types. There's not all, like, oh my god. Uh, there's like a lot of different kind of types of like gun styles people can use. Yeah, different variants. It gives you different uh, outcome. Yeah. Personally, the things I like the most out of it is just like it feels like an old COD. At first, when you look at it at the gameplay or whatever, it's like okay, it's too futuristic. <laughs> it's like shit. It's like Destiny or Halo, whatever. But personally, when you start playing it and get used to it, you really enjoy it and you feel like it's an old Call of Duty, but in the future, you know? So. The only thing I got really bitch about is like the snipers. The snipers are too good. I mean, like really, like, ugh. How like good they're is nasty. It? Especially on, Especially on Terminal, I got to say 100 out of 10. Because all of them are basically a one-shot kill. All right. What else do you guys don't like about like, it? Also, the health is a little inconsistent. Stop starting my music. Yeah, uh, me. health regeneration, stuff like that. Yeah, health regeneration is really that. slow. Like, so basically, it's like the speed of like health coming back up. It's slower than Black Ops 3, so you basically die faster. Yeah. Well, like you like... die like the same pace, but like your health just stays low for a longer period of time. Hey, I do agree with you. I feel like I'm doing a fucking news reporter here. Like, yeah, 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 that sounds great. Like, <laughs> it's so weird. I'm not used to this stuff. But um, mm -hmm. I do have to agree with you. And sometimes it's like, like Chaz says and Blake was saying, is that like, it's inconsistent because sometimes you could like literally melt those kids and then sometimes you can't melt them or you eat or them eat. You know, it's super freaking weird. So how's your thoughts about the specialists in this game? Why I'm saying this is because I put oh, them <laughs> Mine right now. Uh, I think they're really good. Like really some good. are better than others. Like the claw and the eraser are much better than the synaptics equalizer. Like, do you think like they that. need to be buffed? I also like the uh, spe the special traits are a nice uh, addition. Like they're not overpowering good, but some yeah. they help in some situations. I, like I the combat burst helps you get out of uh, sticky situations, and then the uh, FTO guy he has like a thing where if you're getting tired and you're getting really shot at, the screen turns a bright yellow. I mean, sometimes it confuses the shit. I mean, like, wait, what's happening? Why is my screen turning yellow? Where am I getting targeted from? <laughs> like, I wish instead so, of just, like, your entire screen turning yellow, I wish, you would show, I wish you would turn yellow in a corridor where you were being targeted from, like, to your left, right behind you in an angle. Alright. So, basically, it's, like, six cents, but as a specialist. It's, well, like, six really, cents, well, but glad really glad nerfed. About... That, do you remember in Black Ops 3, like the tracking and uh, whatever it's called? The, um, Tracker? The or engineer or whatever? Or, um, I know you mean the footsteps. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Um, I'm just glad I signed the game anymore, dude. That was uh, that was really dumb. Oh, do you see your footsteps or whatever? Yeah, that oh, and yeah, then the six cents one. Yeah, the six cents one is not oh, the... in here, but the uh, tracker is still in here though. You rarely see. Wait, oh, is the tracker in here? Six yeah, cents it's... is a trait for the FTL guy, but it's not like where you can see someone in the corner. It's when you're getting targeted, so it's not that overpowered. Yeah, let's see. Personally, I like the guns as well. Like, let's like vice versa a bit of like I like and I don't like. Mm -hmm. I like the guns in this game. It's just it feels smooth and like I find it's really comfortable. Like it, it looks like the old COD, but like they bring back a lot more classics. You know, like this one I'm using really? right now. It looks game, like the Pini. In this game, if you have good movement, then you will be you, you, you will do good. Like in this game, if you have good movement, you'll do good. Yeah. Oh. Cheeky. Camping in the corner. But yeah. I just if you know how to use it, if you have a scuff or a play ball or whatever um remote it could um you know help you do the movement and you use that as your advantage because a lot of people won't think of that right now. They just trying to enjoy it. But hopefully they did change a lot of things, you know, like the guns like I was like we were saying, the guns has to be changed a lot. Some of them are like literally like two bullets oh. and dead. So oh, I gotta kill. And the specialist side, the specialist, I don't know. Do you find their balance or no? Uh, um, yeah, here and there. Like Claw yeah. is really good at get like for clearing out a corridor, and the Eraser it's just good in one-on-one -on -one battles. Because I mean, like it disintegrates people for yeah. for good to say. So yeah, uh, the game is almost over here, guys. It's just if you, I hope this helps you to decide should you buy it or should you get it for Christmas. Personally, my rating oh, yeah. for also, this is a seven. Hey, what's up? My rating for is like a eight or seven point five. Oh yeah, and the assault rifles in this game are godly. You use an assault rifle, you're gonna be pretty good. All right. Because you can clear, you can just use it at all ranges. It doesn't matter. Especially the K bar. The K bar is overpowered. I didn't try the burst weapons yet, but I sh should I try them though? Oh, it's pretty. It's it's good, but it's just pretty. It's a it's a pretty slow uh trip, burst shot. All right. But it's so, pretty good. Like I said, guys, if you did like, hopefully this helped you a bit to decide if you guys really want to um, buy the game or not. Personally, I give it a seven out of ten. You know, not not everything is perfect, but I do enjoy playing with it, and hopefully, playing with friends in the real game if it's gonna make it two times better. How about your guys' uh, ratings? I yeah, just can't for the game. I just can't wait to actually. play more. I wish I could play it more. Yeah, a little bit more too. Like I want to see more uh, things, like more th uh, things in the game. How about you, Blake? Well, what rating do you get? Yeah, I give it a seven out of ten. Yeah, I agree with you. Pretty good. You know, some things have to be. Changed I, I wonder what kind of probably. DLC weapons they'll add if they add DLC weapons. <laughs> Most likely they will, but yeah, hopefully this helps you to get the game. Personally, if you're a COD fan like all three of us in a party, and most of my friends are, you should buy it because it doesn't matter what type of skin Call of Duty is, Call of Duty will be always Call of Duty. Isn't that right, boys? Right. Thanks, Blake. I appreciate it, my man. But, um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it's been your boy, DJ Hot Sauce. I'm, I'm out. Peace.